It's time for Anello Answers It, and this week we're talking about an interesting story of a dust devil that's been circulating all across the country. This is a 7U baseball team in Florida, and let's just take a look at exactly what happened. Their catcher is in for a surprise. Let's see if we can get it to roll. Here you go. Now take a look at the catcher. He's minding his own business, and boom. Look at that, a gigantic dust devil just appears out of nowhere over home plate. The umpire thankfully jumps in and is able to save the day and protect the kids. But exactly what happened there and why? Well, that's a great question. Let's go ahead and talk about it. Now, of course, what formed there is called a dust devil. But how do those dust devils form? Well, it all starts with diurnal heating or daytime heating. That's when the sun hurts heats the surface of the earth. Next, what's formed is a low pressure system. Now, air comes into low pressure systems on the ground and then funnels north into higher elevations in the sky. And that's exactly what happened in that last situation we just saw. Now, as the air is coming in and then pushing north, it's bringing in dust that's been heated by the sun and is very dry and it causes it to go up into the sky and start to spin. But here's the thing about dust devils, they're self-sustaining. So until it runs out of that dust, it can stay in the air as long as that air is pushing it into the low pressure system and north. Eventually though, what happens is cooler air comes into the into the mix and that eventually dissolves the dust devil. So that happened pretty quickly in that video. It was here one second and gone the next, but nevertheless, what an interesting sight. Well, that's all for Anello Answers It this week. If you have a weather question, be sure to email it to me at gianello at waytv.com because I would love to hear from you.